A case of road rage ends with gunfire, and tonight one driver is hospitalized with critical injuries. And now police are questioning the driver who opened fire. Good evening, I'm Jim Benneman. And I'm Karen Lee. Thanks so much for being with us tonight. Right now, southbound Parker Road is open again. Police say this all started on I-225. Both drivers exited onto Parker. Sean Chitness joins us live from the scene right now with the very latest. Sean. Well, Karen, we know that police have talked to both drivers, asking them questions about what exactly happened, and that those two drivers did eventually stop, pull over, and each called 911. Police did have to close a stretch of Parker Road while they were looking for evidence, including possibly some shell casings. Now, we still don't know exactly what happened, but we understand that it likely began on Interstate 225. Both cars were exiting onto the southbound end of Parker. One driver actually stopped in the middle of the road. That was the driver of a BMW. The other went into a nearby parking lot. We don't know yet who got shot in which car, but police are interviewing both drivers and they want to urge everyone to flat out avoid road rage. Brake checking, cutting each other off, flipping each other the bird, right? These are all things that may feel good in the moment, but can lead to bigger things like this that someone gets hurt, injured, shot, whatever it may be. Uh, these are things that we want to avoid and we don't want ever to happen. And so Aurora police are now asking witnesses to come forward with any more information. Uh, as we mentioned, there was one person who had to go to a local hospital because of this shooting. We understand that they had critical injuries, but they are expected to survive. And at this hour, we can report that both Parker Road and I-225 have reopened. Live tonight in Aurora, Sean Chitness covering Colorado First.